what a morning it's been uh, day nine uh, I just wanted to say to everyone following on social media a huge thank you for all the the, the messages uh, not not just this morning but over the last week it's been incredible the level of support for for the ride so far and uh, whilst I can't personally get back to everyone I, I'm, I'm seeing a lot of it and some of the comments the replies are actually coming from Nikki my wife um, and then she sends stuff through to me on what's happened so it tells me what's going on so a huge thank you for all the support uh, this morning was um, yeah I set out early as as always and it was raining and um, about an hour in I stopped because I was I was too cold put an extra jacket on I was just riding out a garage and there was just lots of water on the and I, I, I thought it was just a bit of sitting water and my, my, my front wheel went in and it was just a huge hole. Um, the bike just stopped. It went, I went from about 15 miles an hour. I wasn't going fast. And straight over. And um, I guess I hit the road with my face and my left hand. Um, I really thought I'd done a lot of damage to begin with because the first thing I felt was, was broken tooth in my mouth. I thought, I thought I'd really damaged my teeth. Um, so go back to the van, Laura did an amazing job uh, looking after me. Um, I've chipped a, a good amount of my sort of my canine tooth there, about a quarter of it's gone entirely. Um, it's not the end of the world. It'll be a couple of months before I can get to a dentist, I guess. Um, but as the day's gone on, my left elbow's given me more grief. So um, yeah, I guess I staved it, which I, I don't exactly know what that means at this point. You know, I guess I landed on it and the, whether it's bone or muscle or tendon, but really painful on the bike. So. Um, yeah, I can ride, I'm still covering the miles, but um, I'll get some treatment now. But uh, I'm okay, that's the main point. The ride goes on, and um, yeah, thanks for all the support, everyone.